Well, drivers could be feeling the pain at the pump once again as gas prices take an upward trend. That's right. AAA is reporting prices in Northeast Ohio soared 26 cents in the last week. Now, average prices in the Youngstown area are still on the lower end compared to the rest of Northeast Ohio at $2.78. The average price in Ohio tonight is just under 3 bucks a gallon. Gas Buddy shows prices a bit higher around $2.85 in Youngstown and $3.19 per gallon in Niles. So as prices head up after the holidays, could there be more reasons to send them skyrocketing? Leslie Huff explains how Israel's war in Gaza is causing global chaos in the oil and gas industry. In response to Israel's war in Gaza, Houthi militants in Yemen are attacking oil tankers traveling through the Red Sea, one of the world's most essential shipping routes. Oil companies like Shell and BP have suspended shipping through the route. Some industry experts believe this may cause gas prices in the U.S. to increase over the next six months to a year. The way gas speculation prices go, we're going to probably see an increase pretty soon. Uh, but I think Shell even said that look forward to you know, 10 to 15 percent gas in increases as we're going along. It's because oil companies are now forced to find different trade routes to avoid any airstrikes. Many oil and gas tankers are rerouting all the way around Africa, adding almost 10 days to their trips. They're trying to reroute shift, which is costing them more money. And uh, ultimately, that's going to then be passed on to you and me. But an expert in the petroleum industry tells me it's still uncertain if this disruption will affect U.S. gas prices because the majority of oil materials are locally sourced around the Americas. We're not as affected if, if tankers can't go through the Red Sea because our most of our oil and gas that we use in refining in the U.S. is not coming from the Red Sea. But both experts agree that if the attacks in Yemen spike, so could the price at the pump. With more local news, I'm Leslie Huff.